What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome to the first Team of the Year video. Um, let's, I want to refresh this, I want to see what this image is. The Team of the Year is here guys, it has been announced, there should be an image here. I guess the site is overrun with people. Uh, the Team of the Year is actually not today. It says as you can see here, Team of the Year, T-O-T-Y, is on from January the 9th to January the 16th. So seven days. So is it released tomorrow? Woo! I thought it was going to be next week. Um, the top 11 footballers of 2016, uh, including <laughs> what? <laughs> including Ronaldo, Messi, Modric, Ramos, and Neuer, have been announced at award ceremony in Zurich. This is last year's EA. This link is last year's EA. You've got it all wrong. Right. There's a new thing. Here we go. Um, let's pop this up. We've got a new thing. So it's not those dates. I didn't think it was until next week. They linked the wrong link first. Funny EA. Team of the year. Learn more about how this team of the year is being selected and see which players have been nominated. So, hey, that's nice. Nice little box. Attackers. Ooh, Mbappe. The ballot box. For the first time ever, the team of the year will be voted on by a carefully curated list of media, athletes and EA Sports FIFA community members. Not me. This collective of ballot recipients has been chosen to represent the millions of EA Sports FIFA players all over the world. Each of them will be selected from a shortlist of 55 players nominated by EA Sports for their real-world performance in 2017. Custom-built ballot boxes will be delivered to each recipient on January the 8th, not me, containing all 55 of the nominee player items. Each vote will consist of three attackers, three midfielders, four defenders, and one goalkeeper in a 4-3-3 formation. Each ballot recipient will cast their vote by posting a photo of their team on social media with hashtag team of the year vote by January the 12th. So they get four days to do that. The ballot submitted by this group will account for 60% of the final vote. The remaining 40% of the votes will be cast by EA Sports. The final team of the year will be announced starting on January the 15th with special team of the year player items in packs for a limited time in FIFA 18 Ultimate Team and FIFA Mobile. The goalkeeper nominees, Jean-Luigi Buffon, David De Gea and Hugo Lloris. So what we're going to do is we're going to pick, I'm going to pick my team of the year as if I was able to vote. And I want you guys in the comments below to pick your team of the year. So we're allowed to pick one goalkeeper, four defenders, three midfielders and three attackers. So I would go with, out of these goalkeepers, Buffon, De Gea, Lloris, Navas and Oblak. I personally would still go with Buffon in terms of footballing world. I'm going to pick two team of the years. I'm going to pick the deserved team of the year in my opinion and the FIFA team of the year, the, what I would want to see because of how FIFA is played. Don't care about Oblak. I think Navas has got a good chance. Having picked up numerous team and individual honours since arriving at Real Madrid, Navas has established himself as one of the world's best goalkeepers. Navas has got a decent opportunity. I personally think for real world Buffon, for FIFA, David De Gea. They would be my goalkeeper picks 100%. Let me know in the comment section below your guys' picks as well. Defenders. So we get four defenders. Alaba, Alba, Alonso, Alves, Azpilicueta, Benucci, Carvajal, Godin, Kimmich, Koulibaly, Luis, Luis, Marcelo, Piquet and Ramos, <clears throat> Sandro, Silva and Valencia, Walker and Vertonghen. Now in terms of real life, real world, I think we're looking at Ramos again. I think we're looking at Marcelo again. I think we're looking at Dani Alves and Benucci. I think the team of the year, funnily enough, the team of the year that it actually was is probably what I would go with. Now, in terms of FIFA, what would I go with? I would go with David Alaba, I think, because I love this card's base card. So a team of the year David Alaba would be insane. I wouldn't go with Alba nor Alonso because I just don't use Premier League or La Liga much this year. I definitely wouldn't go with Danny Alves. As Pilicueta wouldn't like, Benucci wouldn't like. Again, this, is, this would be my team of the year FIFA 18 picks. I would probably go with Kimmich because his car would be insane. Uh, it would be like high 90s everywhere. Um, I would also go with Marcelo and Ramos. So yeah, I would go... Ooh. Damn, there's too many... Good, man, I don't know who I'd take for FIFA actually. Because <coughs> Alexandro, Marcelo and David Alaba are all three players that I use and love a lot. And they're all left back, so I can't use them all. 
In terms of right backs, might go with Valencia right back because I use his regular card and it's awesome. I'd go with Sergio Ramos. I'd go with Marcelo and I'd use Marcelo and Sergio Ramos on the left hand side. And then I would go with. I'd probably still go with David Alaba and even use him as a sub or a midfielder on 7 chem or something. That's probably my picks there. I'd go with Alaba, Marcelo, Ramos and Valencia. I know I've picked three fullbacks and that doesn't necessarily make sense. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Whoa. But that's what I would personally go with. Midfielders. Thiago, Deli Alli, Casemiro, De Bruyne, Dybala, Eriksson, <coughs> Forsberg, Isco, Kante. Krusa, Modric, Nengolan, Robben and Verratti. Robben's an interesting one to see there. Didn't he spend most of the year injured? <coughs> um, the speedy Dutchman remains one of the world's best wingers and his quality was evident this season. Few players can match his pow prowess when cutting inside from the right. And Robben's finishing ability, even from distance, is as phenomenal as ever. Not wrong. Um, in terms of real world, again, Modric and Kroos, you can't really overlook. There's some, uh, there's some choices here, man. De Bruyne is a good shout. Kante is a good shout. Isco is a good shout. Funnily enough, funnily enough, Andres Iniesta, who is a selected Team of the Year player, will not be in the FIFA 18 Team of the Year. So, who would I pick from this set of players? I would definitely pick that De Bruyne card, because his card is insane anyway, and I, I could imagine a Team of the Year De Bruyne would be immense. Who else would I pick? Forsberg, definitely not. Eriksen, most likely not. Dybala, no. Ali, Thiago. Casemiro, we'd leave him on, on the maybe maybe line. So we get three. I would definitely pick De Bruyne. <clears throat> I personally would go with Nangolan, De Bruyne and Modric. Can get some good links with Nangolan and De Bruyne being Belgian. We can throw Modric in there. Gets links with Ronaldo, Marcelo and Ramos that we've already picked. Uh, De Bruyne also links with uh, Valencia. Would get a soft link in there. Nengolan doesn't link with the other defender that I picked, but um, yeah, that's probably who I would go with. Verratti, I would never choose. Not for FIFA anyway. Maybe in real life, he deserves it potentially. I don't even think so, but uh, for FIFA, just definitely not. FIFA for Robben, again, no, because of that two-star weak foot, just not interested. Rajan Angolan, yes. Luka Modric, yes. Tony Kroos, no, because of the pace. Kante for FIFA, yes. Isco for FIFA, no. I used his team of the season last season, a 95 Isco, and it was as good or as bad as just any other good midfielder. You know, I don't think there's anything special about him there. Forsberg, no. Ericsson would be an insane team of the year card in FIFA. Five-star, four-star, crazy good stats. Dybala would be an insane team of the year as well. Sorry if I said team of the season, I meant team of the year. Uh, Dybala would be an insane team of the year as well. You know, obviously uh, four-star, four-star, I believe. Great pace, great dribbling, great shooting. That physical boost it will get will be insane. De Bruyne would be amazing. Casemiro would be very good as well. I'm not. I'm not sure. I'm gonna do. If I ha so, I've picked my goalkeeper. I picked my four defenders. My three midfielders would be De Bruyne, Modric, and Nangolan. That's who I would pick personally for my three midfielders. Let me know again, guys, who you would pick in the description. In the comment section below, sorry. And then last but not least, guys, the forwards. Sergio Aguero, Edison Cavani, Philippe Coutinho. He's a left wing. That should be a midfielder. Um, Hazard, Kane, Griezmann. Lewandowski, Lukaku, Mbappe. Mertens, Messi, Neymar. Ronaldo, Sanchez, Suarez. Did we already see Suarez? Have they put Suarez in here twice? No, it was Cavani. I mean, wow. I don't even know who i pick out of this. See, now, in terms of FIFA, right, we are talking specifically and legitimately FIFA only. I don't know if I would take Ronaldo. And the reason being is because his 95 team of the group stage card is already insane. He's definitely going to get other informs throughout the year, 96 and 97. So to take him up to a 99 would almost be a waste of a card, you know. So I would take... I would. Mm, who would I take here? For FIFA perspective only, who would I take? Definitely not Cavani, definitely not Coutinho. I would take Hazard. Another Belgian, links with that De Bruyne, links with that Nangolan. I would take Hazard for sure. I wouldn't take Griezmann. I wouldn't take Kane. I might take Aguero. 
I personally wouldn't take Luka, uh, Lewandowski just because of the fact that he doesn't fit the team. But I would take Team of the Year Lukaku. I also would take Team of the Year Mbappe. And again, what's the point of taking Messi and Ronaldo when they're down to get Team of the Season cards? I still think Ronaldo will get a Team of the Season card, even with the fact that he's struggled in the league so far this year. If not, he will definitely get a 98 or a 99 rated card through another method. Messi the same. Messi's already got up to a 95 rated card. He'll go up anyway, and his card is already ridiculous. A Team of the Season card, a Team of the Year card for Messi and for Ronaldo in FIFA would be a waste. Neymar's got that 94 card. It's great. <sighs> There's too many choices here. I would I would love to take Suarez, Neymar, Mbappe, Lukaku, Hazard. Those, those would be my initial five choices. Where would I go after that? Who would I get rid of? I think Hazard, Lukaku I would take because of the Belgian links. And Lukaku would be a machine up front as a team of the year card. As my third and final pick, I'd go Mbappe. Because he's a beast in his game already. Imagine like a 96 rated Mbappe card. Oh man, it would be ridiculous. So that would probably be my trio up front, guys. Hazard, Lukaku and Mbappe. And this is based on not real life performances. Let me make that clear again. This is based on who I would like to see in FIFA. Based on how good their cards would be and how much I would enjoy them. What's going to be really interesting to me is to see what the guys that are voting for pick. Because in the defence, there's a lot of good choices here, man. And... I don't know who's picking them, but if it was me to pick, I wouldn't pick Ronaldo or Messi. I wouldn't pick Neymar. I wouldn't pick... Let's have a look at the midfielders. I wouldn't pick Thiago. I wouldn't pick uh, Dybala, nor Eriksson. I wouldn't pick Kante. I wouldn't pick Tony Kroos. I don't know who these guys are going to pick. It's going to be very interesting to see who's in the team of the year. I guess we find out in four days. Or we actually will find out by looking at the YouTubers and... The, sorry, what was it that they said... I can't remember what it was they said. Uh, the Who was it? The, the, the people that vote, basically. I'll, I'll be looking at the YouTubers and the content creators and the social media experts and so on and so forth. Um, the, the media, the athletes and the EA FIFA community members. I'll be looking at what they vote for. It's going to be interesting to see what comes for Team of the Year. We've got a week to wait, guys. Seven days. So I've got seven days of videos on this channel to make. And then Team of the Year is going to be here for a year. And it's going to be amazing. This, though, is going to be the end of the video. Don't forget, dude. Show me who you want in the description below. In the comment section below. Pick your 11. One goalkeeper, four defenders, three midfielders, three attackers. This is going to be the end of the video for now, guys. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time. I'm out. Peace.